so here we go. <laughs> and Bickersons are at it again. There we go. Jump. Down you go. Jump. Down you go. Whoop. Shit. <laughs> That's right, come here now. Bleeding. bleeding, I didn't even shoot you yet. There we go. Jump. Down you go. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. Usually take him down in one shot. There we go, like that. Probably because I'm not going for the head. Jump. Down you go. <laughs> Seems to be working so far. Jump. Down you go. <laughs> Light should come on now. There we go. Not too shabby. Let's collect all the goodies. Yum yum. Some of the corpses have turned into lockboxes. Potato chips didn't really need that. Oh, big cash, big cash. Yum yum. Pep bar. That'll refill my Eve a little bit. Might as well take that. Another pet bar. I'm going to leave that there for an emergency. Pick that up later. Get a little hungry. Got to remember it's there. Next thing on the agenda, um, let's go get the telekinesis plasmid. It's in here. In the dandy dental area. And uh, let's revitalize or reactivate the security bot. Bring him along. Coming this way. Okay, now that we got the shotgun, this way, buddy. Pretty much invincible. Uh, zap him, and then one shot to the head usually takes down all splicers. Smoke. Do I want to smoke? Let's save that for later. <laughs> Danny Jibs. Just around. Ah, uh, yes. Gas cylinders. We're going to be using a bunch of those to take down a big daddy later on. Uh huh. I know I should have gone upstairs and got an auto hack tool. I wonder if I have an auto hack tool. Yes, I do have one. Um, this isn't a really tough safe. There's another really tough safe uh, over in the other area here. So I'm going to save the auto hack tool for that. And we're done. Hacking safes is important. Safes carry all kinds of good goodies. Eve Hype, I'll use one of those. It's 16 bucks, I can use that. I gotta remember the first date kits there. Alright. In here is the telekinesis plasmid. This thing is going to explain all about it. Objects at distance present no problem. Moving objects through space, no problem. Cannot stop speeding bullets, but can catch and throw faster moving object. Problem not with plasmid. Problem, problem with, with reaction, reaction time. time. Stuchon just get new idea for plasmid. Okay, so here it is, telekinesis to get it free. Just grab it up. And now, um, Pick up, we can catch stuff and throw it back, and pick up stuff and move it around. And I highly recommend you replace your incinerate plasmid with this. Throw objects at foes. You can even catch grenades and throw them back. Alright, so now we have two plasmids telekinesis and electric bolt. That's why I had you, that's why I recommend that you melt both ice blocks before you come down here, right? So a little demonstration. Telekinesis. This machine is going to shoot out tennis balls. Catch them. Oops. Okay. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> there we go. And if you just press the, um, well, for me it's the Q button, you can just drop stuff and it won't use up any Eve. Okay? It only uses up Eve when you throw it back, okay? By releasing the, um, the fire button, okay? You catch it using the fire button and you throw it back by releasing the fire button. Okay, so that's that. Let's switch to electric bolt here. Take care of this Hello? lunatic here. Come in the water. Like oh, missed. Get that. There we go. <laughs> okay, so I switched back to my weapon to avoid having to use up an Eve hypo to refill my Eve. And there's a pep bar out there. Oh, cigarettes here. That'll do just fine. Take the cigarettes. Fill my Eve a little bit. Now we can grab this. Um, actually, not just yet. I want to make sure the coast is clear. Do I hear it? Where is that? I hear my security bot ticking faster and faster. It's about to blow. Really, here he is. Up you go. <laughs> She's gonna blow! Look out! Uh, I just want to make sure this nitro splicer out here is not gonna give us a hard time. Trying to get this thing out of the way. Security out of the way. There he is. It's him. See, that's a nitro splicer. Throwing bombs at us. Like we can catch him and throw him back at us. Yeah. Get him, R2D2. Yeah. Get that fucker. Come on, get in the war. Get up there. There he comes. Get down! Ah, shit, I blew my security button. Oh, plenty more they need. <laughs> As for blowing my security button, you little bastard. <laughs> okay. Now, this gurney, okay. Let me get this out of the way here. Next, gas cylinder. Use that. I'm going to start stockpiling gas cylinders to take care of the big daddy at the end. There's seven to be had in this level. There we go. And there's three of them to pick up downstairs. So I'm going to pick up the three and stockpile them here. Okay, one. Now, next thing on the agenda, a quick save. Next, let's go get the wrench jockey uh, plasmid that's in here. It's a turret we gotta watch out for. There, down there. Zap it. Hack it. And she's done. Best thing you want to do is get out of the way because this thing will start firing at um, splicers that it sees, and usually you take some luck of damage with because the fucker doesn't know how to aim correctly. So he's shooting at a splicer in there. You done? Damn, you put a hurting on me, bitch. Shit. <laughs> okay. Anyways, thanks for the help. Yum yum. Wrench jockey plasma is right there. I'll show you how to get it. You have to go through a secret area. I have to use the wrench. Hunker down here. Whack out this grate here. Whack out this grate here. Continue early your life of crime by rifling through the pockets of all dead guys, you see. And wrench jockey increases the power of the wrench. Definitely want that. Now, at the beginning of the game, I showed you uh, I could 
Thuggish Splicers, I believe. You zap them once and you had to whack them three or four times on hard difficulty to take them down. Now I should be able to take this guy down with just one whack. Zap him. And aim for the head. And down she goes. So, as you can see, the uh, wrench jockey plasma makes your wrench a lot more powerful.